fine. It's fine. Go to Ted Farrow's office. Okay. Good God, this building's a death trap, huh? Like, good Lord, where are we? This is, I mean, this is just the whole corporation. Uh, they probably have their own campus. They probably got like a, an arena on here. Soccer fields, basketball courts, everything. They got everything. off Seattle Seahawks you guess this is why I don't watch them I told you guys we lose by the Bears we lose to the Bears by one after all that dude I'm just sick of them bro I, I see my blood is boiling and I didn't even watch this is why I decided not to watch today they just me off quit trying to get me high crew sick Just drop down. Hey, wait. Do I go up? What's up? What's up there? I'm gonna keep going. Oh no, it wants me to go up here. I think. I don't know. There's too many damn options. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. An alternate route, if you will. <laughs> oh, it, it just took me right back. I'd have the to same ditch something. Place. I'd have to ditch something? I'm gonna go jump off this tower again. Come on, where the, where the hell is the goddamn boardroom? Where's this office? You know this is the type of dude to have like a pistol underneath his desk with a giant red button with a trap door. That's the kind of office I want. <gasps> Not again! <gasps> Not again! Imagine, Aloy, fighting fucking giant monster robots. And you can't you can't walk along a ledge! God, this game! Oh, come on, dude, me. It's the game's fault, not mine. I'm going all the way up. No, there was definitely no prompt to hang. I don't know what you're talking about. There was definitely no button that said press C to hang. Okay, that never came up. I can assure you of that. And a C incident. Oh, I bet there was many incidents. Hey, what's over here? Nice. Right, so let me in, motherfucker. See, that's a little boardroom. A way up. All it takes is a few good handholds. Yeah. And we're at the top. All right, made it. Wonder what we'll find. That uh, hell of an office up here. Do you wish to deploy item privileges to recover purge data? What? Oh yes, I believe I do. A file has been recovered. Scan the data point. Yo, Zabel, what's up, BB? Happy holidays, bro. Thank you for the 54. October 31st, 2064. Uh, it's been years. Where's your legal team, Ted? No need. I dropped all 18 lawsuits the moment you landed. I assume your data confirms this. All right, this promises to be interesting. Perhaps we could have lunch brought in. You know, get reacquainted. I know you, Ted. You screwed something up, something big, or you wouldn't have eaten the crow necessary to get me here. 
You hitting on my mom? There's a glitch in the chariot line. You're killer robots? Peacekeepers, yes, those. So shut them down. <laughs> Obviously, Liz, we would if we could. They're not responding. Are you telling me? Yes, Obo, yes, protected? spoilers. It's worse than that. <sighs> Show me the data then. And I'll take that lunch alone. Damn, bro. Hit him with the alone. He's, she said, get the Ten fuck out. I got work to do. So back here, but they hated each other. Why is she built like that, bro? She is built like a linebacker. This isn't a glitch. It's a catastrophe. Fully aware. It's bad. Bad? Jesus, Liz. It's not bad, Ted. Liz. It's apocalyptic. You built a line of killer robots. Peacekeepers. That consume biomass as fuel. In emergencies. <laughs> and you made them capable of self-replication. Oh, you're dumb as fuck, Ted. Manufacture controlled. Not anymore. The glitch severed chain of command. The only nation this swarm answers to now is itself. What? You, you think I did? Everything else is just food. And at the rate it's replicating, Ted, it will strip the Earth bare in 15 months. We're not talking the fall of civilization. We're talking extinction. I get it, Liz. So how do I stop it while it's contained? It's not contained. It can't be. Yeah, you know what I mean? You fucked this up, Ted. Right. Before the truth gets out, you mean. Liz, I will do anything you say. Keep working it, and whatever you recommend, I'll do. I'm gonna hold you to that, Ted. You killed everyone, Ted. You ruined the world. You nearly killed all the human race. The Faro robots threatened all life on Earth, but somehow she defeated them. The world of the old ones fell, but life went on, or we wouldn't be here. Well, you know, humans are like cockroaches. I'm sure there's a few of them that'll survive no matter what. Project Zero Dawn. Zero Dawn, name of the game. There has to be another way. If there are a nicer way to fix your mess, I would have proposed it. But this? This? When I asked you to find a cure, I didn't expect it to be worse than the disease. It's not, Ted. It may be grim, but it's our only chance. Now sign the proposal. Damn. Sign it? I can't sign that. Oh, Ted, you said you would do yes, anything. That? Liz, I cannot in good conscience sign that. Ted, you're such a You've bitch. You've got a choice, Ted. I know. I am speaking to you from a VTOL en route to U.S. Robot Command. In 15 minutes, I meet with General Harris and the rest of the Joint Chiefs. What? What? Are you crazy? Now your choice is what I tell them. Sign, and I'll tell them the wealthiest corporation on Earth has guaranteed the funds necessary to build Zero Dawn. Exactly as I've designed it. Zero Dawn is also an AI, sure right? They and everyone else on this planet knows the real cause of the glitch. Jesus, Liz. You don't have to threaten me. I'll sign. Look on the bright side, Ted. From here on out, you get to do what you've always been good at. Footing the bill while others get their hands dirty. Damn, bro! She ain't holding back. God forgive me. I think I'm starting to remember this part. Project Zero Dawn has like so multiple stages Why that all work together to re robots? so they can rebuild for humans, right? Something like that, but it didn't work. Something like that. I feel like I'm starting to remember it a little bit. But or I'm fucking talking about some other game. But I swear it's this game. Yo, give me all that. What the hell? Oh. Dude, imagine if I had a glider. It'd be lit. Or a parachute or I don't know, man. Just something. Oh, I can jump up here. Oh, look at this. More loot. I can't spare the weight. Wait, no. This is where I came down, huh? Wait, is that where I came down?
No, I didn't come up. I didn't go up here. Aim for the bushes. Yeah, all these machines and they don't have any way to fly. <laughs> okay. Like you wouldn't create machines that could fly. Oh, there's a power cell right here. These power cells. What do they do? Wouldn't you like to know? Lego. Executive access detected. Express left. Nice. This, this doesn't add up. Sobek couldn't have been my mother. She lived ages ago. Because she's this not your mother. And I'm still no closer. Is that your reaction to everything you just learned? To whine like a spoiled child? Damn. You should really try talking that way to me face to face. As you wish. Do you really have no idea how monumental are the discoveries you just made, Aloy? I expected more of you. So, you have a face. Got a name to go with it? Of all the questions you could ask right now, that's the one you choose. I've spent decades searching the ruins of the old ones, trying to solve the mystery of what happened to them. For years, I've suspected that feral robots destroyed their civilization, but I could never confirm it. And in minutes, you uncover more ancient knowledge than I have in a lifetime, and what you want to know is my name. Silence. That's my name. Silence. Now, why don't you try asking another question? Something less trivial. He's such a dick. If you're so smart, why do you know so little after a lifetime scratching around in the dirt? Tell him, Aloy. It's not my fault you're bad at what you do. Damn! I came to these ruins looking for Elizabeth Sobek, not because of the things she did centuries ago, but because people are trying to kill me right now, today. I've got bigger problems to deal with than your crap. Congratulations. You just graduated from whining to throwing a temper tantrum. I'm sure Elizabeth would be proud. I don't give a fuck about you what you're saying, Silence. And start thinking straight. You're not my dad. Only then will you see just how big your problems really are. What exactly are you talking about? You've chased a personal riddle into a crowd of larger mysteries. The common thread is your connection to Elizabeth Subic. But what is that connection? She couldn't have been my mother if she lived centuries ago. We don't know the connection yet. The only way to find out is to keep going, to keep making discoveries. Thanks to you, we've only just now learned that Pharaoh robots once threatened to end life on Earth. But it didn't happen. The Old One's civilization was destroyed, but life... life was saved. Obviously. So, what did Elizabeth do? How did she stop the robots before all was lost? What was Project, Project Zero Dawn? Exactly the question. Now, are you ready to go get the answer? Yes, sir. Of course I am. I'm ready. Then why are you still standing here? <laughs> He's such a dick. You're insufferable, you know that? <laughs> Let's get on with this. <laughs> he really Elizabeth is. Elizabeth told Ted Faro she was headed for a place called U.S. Robot Command to tell people about Zero Dawn. The place still exists as a ruin. The Asaram call it the Grave Horde. Oh, that sounds like a great place Grave to go. Horde. The Grave Horde. Cherry name. You'll find it in the eastern mountains, buried under the tangled coils of a metal devil. Oh, fantastic. You are seven Horus, rather, as we're learning to call them. Oh, this is Horus. I'll contact you when you get there. This is the other one that we said we, we haven't found yet. Someday it's the replicating person, one. And your manners had better I think there's only one of them, though. Which would make sense. Mount repair, combat over. Uh, what do we want to save for? I'm almost all 30, so. Well, getting down will be a lot faster than getting up here, at least. U.S. Robot Command. Next. Bro, I'm older than the secrets of Zero Dawn. my level in game.
In game, in game, it's fine. I was just testing it. You guys wanted me to do it, so I tested it. And we Come on, let me go all the way down, man. He was really, really tossing my fucking salad right now. Tiny meat. <laughs> hey, George, look, it's you. Yo, Ace, thank you for the 17 months, man. Welcome back, bro. How you doing, my dude? I got to go all the way over here. Jesus Christ. Wait, actually? Okay. There's so much shit to do over here, too. This is like the original area. It's so snowy. Wait, there's an ancient vessel over here. We should probably just do that real quick. Since I'm in the area. I feel like I should restart my game and take off the face mod. Since it's so... Look out below! What? Since it's so bugged, you know? The hell is she talking about? The map is so cluttered it makes you uncomfortable. I kind of feel that. It is really cluttered. I can always turn some of the icons off. But yeah, I, I feel that. Come on! Squeeze your little fucking cheekies in there. Cheeky breaky. How do we get in there? Down there? Or on top? What the fuck? Ah. Fuck off, you dirty rat. Wait, what? Where is this thing? Oh, it's right here. There we go. Do a little corrupted zone real quick. All right, actually, before we do that, I'm going to go save. Woo! Uh, I'm not using any, like, crazy mods. Uh, a lot of quality of life mods. And, like, visual stuff. I'm really not using that many. There's, there's really not... You know, the vast majority of the mods in this game, you know what they're for? To make Aloy nude. And I'm not kidding. That's what they're fucking for. Yo, Feels Beard, thank you for the five months, brada. I appreciate you, dude. Thank you, thank you. Uh, can we just fast travel? Wait, do I have a steed? I don't. Uh, then I'm just gonna fast travel over to it. We're gonna go do this override. Jesus Christ, dude. Thank God. This is like the one time I'm so happy my office is super warm. Because I just took the dogs out too. And it is, it's actually snowing. So it's fucking freezing. Yeah, them soon enough. My balls are shriveled, man. God damn. I've never seen my testicles so goddamn small. Chat, I had to, not even that long ago, had to explain to Steph that uh, us men, when um, it's very cold, our, our 
our balls go in inside of us. Our testicles uh, go inside of our body. Uh, she was very confused about that. She said, what do you mean? I said, they hide. They go up inside. They hide. They're trying to stay warm. It's very, it's very scary. Sometimes your, your sack turns into a little brain. Just a singular brain. She didn't really understand that part. Looking like a little mini mega mind. They do. They go into hibernation, man. They got to keep themselves. They go into survival mode. Like a walnut. <laughs> Dude, it really do be looking like a walnut, oh, too. Ooh. How do you explain that? You know, at first, when they, if they don't know what it is, why, why does it look like that? Well, let me tell you. Why don't you sit right there? Let me tell you why it be looking like a walnut. Survival mode, all right, woman. Cauldron Zeta. Oh shit! It means one that is it an invisible stalker? Shit! Oh, there's three of them lit. No, no, no. Well, that's gonna hurt me. Whoop. See ya. Little twofer. There should be one more. There it is. Oh god, I'm actually. Stalkers, no problem. No problem. Uh, yeah, we watched Don't Look Up yesterday. It was fucking fantastic. I actually kind of went into it with really low expectations, but I really liked it. I didn't realize... I didn't really know what type of movie it was either, and then I have like... Not halfway through, but like probably 15 minutes in, I'm like, is this satire? This is satire, isn't it? This is fucking genius. I was just dying. Yo, Briscoe, thank you for the nine months. Welcome back, brother. All right. Stalkers have been massacred. This fucking watcher up here is terrible at watching. Oh my! Okay, bitch. Suck on that, motherfucker. Whoa, 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 whoa! What? Wait, what? Why can't I go in? Unidentified source. What? Wait, why can I not go in? Goldie, well, I think you'd enjoy Don't Look Up. It's on Netflix. Hello? Bro, what? Are you fucking with me, dog?
Maybe I have to go up this. Yeah, Yo, chat, have you guys heard about this movie called Don't Look Up? You guys might like it. Go up. Go in. Oh, I see. Oh, interesting. There's a hidden way. That's right. That's right. I have to go the other easy, way to get out. That's how I get out of there. an alternate route. Find the hidden entrance. Oh, if I just read the actual thing. Go to the cauldron core. Spoopy. What the hell? Mm, giant cryo chamber. Yeah, Gina, what makes you so special? Give me this. Oh, nice. Grabbed it from the depths. You understand? Do you understand how fucking cold that water would be? Dark in a deep, dark cave in, in, under snowy mountains. I'll shake it out later. Jesus Christ, dude. My labia would be just shattered. be frozen rock hard holy shit ah thunder jaw fun times there's two watchers Okay, this seems like it's gonna go super well. Mm-hmm. He walked by it, excuse me? How the fuck did he walk by it? No, no game. No, this is, what is happening? It's my wire. Okay, okay, all right, I can't move. I, it, the game's broken, it's broken, it's fucking broken. It's gonna see that one. Oh no, oh no, God. Where's the goddamn switch? Discharge pylon. Ch chapped lips are the worst. True. Damn, Lapo. That was a good one. I like that. Finally. Taking you long enough. Okay, this is gonna suck, cock, bro. Is he still in the bubble?
Oh god. Where's he going? Come back here. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, this is not good. A rope caster might be pretty good against this thing. Stunned it. Uh, can I actually do anything when it's stunned? No? Oh, except for hit the core. It's right there. Yep, that's what I'm supposed to do. Okay, come on. Oh no! Please! 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 Things are real. Oh, here we go. This is what I was looking for. Ah! Come on, bro. Come on, bro. I was gonna say, I swear I shot off like some fucking heavy weapons on it. Get some bombs. Get some loot. Dude, first fucking try, chat. See? And you guys act like I'm boomer. I'm not boomer. I am young. I'm very young kid. I, I know what you mean though. There's some babies, bro. They just cry a lot. We are very very lucky he is not he is not one of them um i just realized something is depth of field on why is it blurry why is my screen blurry at the top why is my whole screen blurry how do i turn that off again oh my god if I, have i had this on the whole time I think I, I think I might have just hit it on accident. I don't think that's been on the whole time. All right. It is time. Wait. No, we already did that one. Did I already get it? Override. Yo, Briscoe, thank you for the nine, brother. Welcome back, man. Cauldron Zeta. Catherine Zeta Jones. She deeps beneath lasers. Ooh. All right. Zeta overrides available. Which ones? Thunderjaw, Stormbird, and the Rockbreaker. Wait, the Rockbreaker? Is that the one that goes underground and it was fooking me good? Excuse me. Catherine Zeta Jones. She dips in his lasers. Ooh. Looks good. All right. 
right. Feels fucking good, man. All right. Now, onward. Before we get distracted once again. Um... We shall just go. We got a mission. Three, just 3,000 meters away. Oh, I got four skill points. Leader strike. Press uh, left click to perform a silent takedown on heavy and elite human enemies. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. PETA, look away. Bro, there's no shot. Anybody from that works at PETA spends their time on Twitch. Okay. There's no fucking shot. And if they do and they're listening right now, why the fuck are you guys so fucking crazy? You know? My door is open. BRB. Yeah, he slapped my glasses off. He was kind of in a hit mood right there. He's usually not. He really doesn't hit very much. But apparently right there he wanted to be. Okay. Oh, you got your two little escorts. That's a, that's cute. Shell, shell walker. Shell, shell fucker. I'm going to wait for the back one. Wait, I'm hitting its shell. Okay, that's not ideal. Not what I wanted, but... Oh, he don't need to show dominance on camera. Everybody knows that kid, little kid owns me. I'll do anything. I love that little kid. More than anything in this fucking world, all right? He doesn't have to show it at all. He's got me wrapped around his little fingers. That's my baby boy right there. <laughs> That's my baby boy right there. Oh, sorry, Sparks. So you try to you you want this to be more like a George stream? Okay. King Leo 16, thank you so much for the five month resub chat. I'm super, super depressed. Can we get five gifted subs in the channel right now? Because otherwise I will not unpause to play the game. Can we get five gifted subs in the chat right now? It'd be super freaking cool. Thank you so much. Oh, dude, thank you so much. Uh, Bluefin, 23, 25, 27, 29 for the follow. Appreciate you. Thanks for following the channel, bro. Oh, hey, thank you so much. Uh, Blue Fist 22 for the follow. Appreciate that, man. Thank you so much for supporting the channel, bro. Welcome, my slimes. Rusty, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. My slime. Mukiki, thank you for the 66. That's a fucking George stream, okay? Ukiki, you don't have the money to gift, but I can suffer 66 months in a row. Love you, Dad. <laughs> Yo, thank you guys so much. I appreciate you. I was just messing. Or or was I? I mean, that's George content in a nutshell right there. I don't know. I don't know what you want from I me. That. That's what you want. That's what you get. This stream really sucks. I haven't gotten enough gifted subs and it's only been 20 minutes. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is that what he says? He says, man, my stream really sucks today. I haven't gotten any gifted subs. <laughs> Listen, guys, can we get 10 gifted subs for my lack of content? It might make me feel better. Because I'm bad. Dude, I mean, hey, if it works, it works. <laughs> Fuck with this, this tree here. No, nope, you don't need to watch. You don't need to watch the, or sorry, you don't need to play the games or read any of the books to watch uh, The Witcher. You'll help. You can watch it by itself. It's actually different than the games and the books, so doesn't really make a difference. I mean, you're, you know, you the only the only difference is you'd probably 
probably know some of the characters more maybe some more backstory shit but that's about it oh wait a ravager i can never no can i, can I do a ravager Dead as fuck. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh my god, it's not what I meant. I thought it was gonna be something. Get out of the water, Aloy! What are you doing? There's no time for a fucking swim lesson. Jesus Christ. Oh, there we go. There's some noble steed when I need it. Finally. Come on, come on. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm playing this on a uh, hardcore mode, so you you die, you have to restart. One life. Right, guys. God, we got another fucking lazy bitch laying on the side of the goddamn road. Find help. Easy now. What's your name? What happened? Hackard. Find help for Pitchcliff. The Glindorks keep attacking. They'll kill my brother. Is that a tattoo on his chest Everyone. or is that a giant scar? Well, is that his intestine? That. What the hell is going on? And look at her face. It's fixed. Oh, he's dead. Death from the skies. Eh. I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure everyone's fine. Hey, excuse me. Are you a merchant? You are a merchant. Mm-hmm. Shadow War Bow. Shadow Sharp Shot Bow. Hmm. I don't have the Shadow Sling, but I could get it now. Which one should I get? The War Bow? This low damage weapon fires elemental, elemental payloads. This slow firing but highly accurate bow is best used for long range combat when target precision is critical. I will be equipping this for this. Yes. Now we'll go to crafting. Oops. Modify weapons. Plus 25% damage. There we go. I got myself a new bow. Oops. Precision arrow and a harvest arrow. Huh. You get some other outfits. That's what I need. All the outfits. All right, let's see. We got to go. This is a whole new area. Actually, no, we got to go back all the way over here. The hell am I doing then? Ash travel. 